Okay, we're on. Do you hear me? Yeah. You hear me? Yeah. Okay. Well. It's public. The stream is running. Okay, so what did you have to do? I just started vMix and ignored everything after that. <laughs> okay, well. Um, and it's, it's using the right camera and all that. Okay. Well, I think that the only ones that we got watching right now are you and me. Yeah. For a second, we had three. I don't know what, what that was, but... Anywho... All right, do you see the chat on the on your uh, on your right? Uh, yes. Okay, good. Okay, I see there's four watching right now. All right, hi guys. You got four, I got two. How can they watch you two times and only me once? How's that work? <laughs> Maybe mine's taking your two and doubling it. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, somebody let us know you're there. Still got that 30 second delay though. You notice that? Mine's not uh, quite that much. It's only about maybe 10 seconds. Okay. Uh, well, we got people watching. Yeah. Now it says uh, four. Mine says six. And now mine says eight. So hey, there's Gavin. Hey, who? Gavin. Gavin's there. Oh, hey, Gavin. Hey, Vicky's there. Vicky. Hi, Vicky. Huntsville, Alabama. Hi, Vicky. That's a Bama girl right there. Yeah. Abalama. <laughs> Lake Lizard. Hey, Lake. We were supposed to get nickel size hail. But it's quarter size. <laughs> Didn't you? Yeah. Well, that'd hurt. Yeah. Did you get any change, Blake? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? Uh, From Somerville. I think, I think those of us in Arizona and Nevada, we'd, we'd just like to have anything that's wet. <laughs> yeah. Heard that. <laughs> Hey, Larry. Hey, Larry. Good to see you here. So, hello, young man. Thunderstorms. He must be watching some Boy, other he video. Know. He's, yeah. <laughs> watching somebody else and listening to us, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Thunderstorms in St. Louis. Aha. Uh -huh. Uh, hey, Lake Lizard, would you send some of those our way? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it is so dry out here, you can... <laughs> well, <laughs> I won't continue that. <laughs> check, check out Gavin's... Check out Gavin's text. <laughs> oh! I, you know, uh, I can't... Gotta, Go ahead. Uh, you can't say that because uh, John's got the controls on his end. I think maybe you ought to take them, though, because I am out of control. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we made it. Yeah. Uh, we made it. We This time it's working. 
Uh, stormy oh my goodness! Upstairs. Too much rain in Alabama. South Carolina. Too much rain in Alabama. Jeez, tropical in Northern Virginia. Stormy here about an John, hour ago. John, we're just ago. on the wrong side of the country. Well, you got that right. Yeah. So. Yeah, we're just on the wrong side of the country, aren't we? That's, that's it. That's exactly right. It's supposed to be another tornado starting down there in the, the Gulf of Mexico, but it's pretty far out. And it always heads to Hawaii after that. John, John well, is a hang DJ. On <laughs> a dumb what? DJ, dumb something. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, hmm. I haven't got a good comeback for that. That's probably a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> Last time we did this, we got ourselves in trouble. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to be on my best behavior today. <laughs> okay. Well, hey, John. Yes, sir. You want to tell us about your knee? Oh, man. Well, yeah, it's uh, it's about halfway. Well, you know, everybody's waiting, so. <laughs> it's about halfway Everybody between wants my to hip know. and my ankle, man. Really? <laughs> yeah. You studied anatomy, huh? Uh huh. Yeah, it's connected to the something bone, and that bone is connected <laughs> to something. Uh, no, but seriously, no, it's uh, it's good. I can't believe it just went away all by itself. But I know I still have to do something about it because it can come back any time, right? Yeah. But you are. Yeah. Uh, you are, so that's that's a good thing. Because I'm going to visit my brother this fall when it's cooler in Phoenix. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's a guy I've been watching. He makes... Uh, I don't know where, it, where, not sure where he lives, but it's in some uh, tropical area, and uh, he's always, it's a, what is it, primitive lifestyle or something, and he's always got a rock on top of a fire, and he's always cooking meat on that fire, so that's pretty much that's the way it is in Phoenix right now. <laughs> They're not cooking eggs down there on the sidewalk, are you, are they? I tried that once, it did cook them, but it didn't taste very good. That's I remember a, one time when I was a kid, uh, they were talking about it being so hot you could f cook eggs on the sidewalk, and yeah. the news media did actually get out there and cook eggs on the sidewalk. I don't think anybody ate them, though. No. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not a good idea, I'm here to tell you, because, you know, you got little pieces of rock and gum and, and you know, yeah. shoes, shoes gum and... <laughs> and spit. <laughs> All right, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So anyway, uh, you're taking care of your your knee problems, and so anyway. Well, Gavin, uh, I haven't talked to him. I won't. I won't be able to talk to him until Wednesday. But going from what other people have told me, that as a matter of fact, Alan was was telling me that uh, a lot of times it can be done as an outpatient. I guess they put a scope in your knee there, and they can look around and repair what damage uh, that they can that way without, you know, full-blown surgery. And I, and there's a lot less recovery time that way. You're ever, you know, you're up and walking around in a couple of days after that. The only thing that's really sore yeah. is where they actually cut you and put the scope in there. So that makes things a little bit sore. But uh, I'm hoping that I can do that. My uh, uh, it primary. All, all depends on what. Sorry. Go ahead. All depends on what the what the problem really is. Whether it's uh, something that can be done by uh, just arthroscopic surgery, or whether they need to do a full knee replacement. But like you said, no one has told you that you need a knee replacement. So. No, nobody has actually said that. 
so we're hopeful that that's that's all it is just uh, something that can be done kind of like outpatient now that could even put new cartilage in there and rebuild it and everything right from the scope so but you know for two or three days it's been great or a week I guess I haven't had any pain at all I got full movement and fixed itself but I've been staying off of it quite a bit too Yeah. Yeah, I guess Gavin Lake says, had a uh, Lake had a uh, hip replacement. It looks like. Ooh. Oh man, that would be even worse than the uh, knee. Yeah. Yeah, because you can always hop around on one leg. You know, it's hard to hop around on one hip. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah. Yeah, I agree, Gavin. It would be. Uh, you know, there's several kinds of of uh, anesthesia they can use. They uh, use a local, and you know, or they can put me out if they want to. But according to uh, some people that I've doc talked to, it doesn't really hurt that much if they use a. Uh, I can't remember what they call it now, but it's in injected in inside the joint, and it numbs everything up, so you can't really feel it. That'd be perfect. Yeah. What, Gavin? Cat poo? What? Cat poo split? Uh, that's that's going back to when we were talking about the eggs on the sidewalk. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oops. Just pulled my thing out. Yeah, there is a little delay. Sorry, Gavin. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's true, Lake. It would be uh, that'd be a whole lot better. Yeah. So I guess I'll do an update the video after Wednesday when I go see him. Goodness, it's that close. Yeah. This month, this month has sailed past. I'm glad. Well, I'm kind of glad, you know. I'm glad you think so. <laughs> well. It seems correct. like the other day it was ten days until your appointment. Yeah. Oh man, Vicky. It was 120 degrees in Phoenix last year at this time. Oh, I remember that too. I was up on the mountain, no AC in the camper, and it was just sweltering up there. Poor Lily, the cat, just laid around in the dark most of the time. <laughs> I'd get her out, you know, with a wet wash rag and wet her down a little bit. She'd sit in front of the fan for a few minutes, and then uh, she'd go off and hide in her dark spot again. I finally, I had to leave. I couldn't do that to her anymore, so... So, travel plans. The sooner the better I can get out of here, the better it'd be. Yeah. This would be a good time to get out, but you can't. Yeah. I went back and looked at some of my other videos, and I was up on the mountain in March last year. Yeah. I remember it being like 26 degrees out by the campfire in the mornings. <laughs> snowed one day, one night, woke up with about an inch and a half of snow on the ground. That's where we need to be right now. Well, right around 10,000 feet. Well, yeah. So what are we going to do? What's your altitude there? Sorry, What's your what? altitude there where you're at? About 3,400. And I'm about 2,000 where, where I'm here in Las Vegas, so. 
It's always hotter in Vegas. About 2,000 feet. Too, yeah. It's always hotter yeah. in Vegas by a few degrees every year. Yeah. It was supposed to get up to 110 today. I don't know what it hit, but yeah. we had one day last week it hit 113. So. Oh man. And that's, that's unusual for this this year. Yeah, I can't take the heat. I can I can take the cold because you can always you know put layers on. But, you know, you can only get down so far to take layers off, you know, and then you could be arrested, you know. <laughs> they probably <laughs> lock you up and throw away the key. <laughs> yeah. I'd scare them to death, I'm telling you. <laughs> Larry, oh. I had my knee worked on uh, back in 94, I think it says. Uh, was back yeah. uh, back on my feet in two days. That's a good deal. Yeah. Uh, Gavin, it's a yeah, it's an F one hundred and it's an eighty one. Hey, that's a classic, isn't yeah. it? Uh, I guess. <laughs> Anything over thirty years is a classic, right? Yeah, I get classic plates on it. Uh huh. Hey, I wonder. I wonder if they give us classic plates. <laughs> I'm over thirty. Yeah. Just put it right on the backside there. Go down the street. Yeah. Somebody asked I've me. I've seen Stranger Things on the strip. <laughs> yeah, <I> bet. <laughs> yeah, and I've seen some clothes that weren't much bigger than a license plate. <laughs> Hey, Scooter, what's up, man? You did make it. Yeah, we used to walk up and down the strip after midnight. And that was, uh, that's kind of fun. <laughs> uh, I don't know that I'd do it now, though. Yeah, down, I get, down, well, people do. Downtown wasn't the place to be. Yeah. Okay, hey, John, just, uh, we only got about a half an hour left. We, we still haven't talked about our fall plans, but uh, the mm -hmm. ultimate uh, destination is still Wyoming. And uh, John, I think uh, you've got a, a particular location that you wanted to go to and see. I spent a lot of time in Evanston, Wyoming. Grandma and Grandpa lived in Rock Springs, but we always used Evanston as a uh, as a stopping point. That's where my uncles and aunts and cousins and all they lived there. So then we'd go to Rock Springs and come back, and uh, you know that area is really flat and windy all the time. But uh, I got some relatives up in Afton, up around Jackson Hole, up in that area, and that is just beautiful up there. I just, I want to spend some time up there as well. I, uh, like I keep saying, I don't want to go up to see any relatives, so <laughs> I don't want to go see any of them. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, Jackson Hole and uh, 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 what's the name of that forest? I can't think of it now. Um, it's a woman's name forest. Flaming Gorge, all up around in there. Northern Utah and southern Wyoming is is uh, pretty nice. And then, uh, Was her name Flaming or Gorge? <laughs> <laughs> no, another forest, man. <laughs> well, you said it was a woman's name, so I just was wondering, was it Flaming? Or? Well, the ex got pretty flaming sometimes, but, you know, that's a different story. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, and, and um, it's been... A lifetime since I was in Wyoming. I remember we drove through there when I was a kid, and I mean a little kid, uh, probably in my early teens, maybe. So I, you know, I don't. When we go there, I don't know what to see. So I was hoping maybe some of the people that uh, are watching 
could uh, give us some some hats or tips on uh, places to see while we're up there. Yeah, you guys speak up if you've been up there and something we should see. I don't get it, Scooter. Said uh, edited some of your music. Did a good job. Out of it. Did I use something of yours? At one time or another. But yeah, if you know, if somebody has got some ideas up there, we can sure check them out. You know, if things go well, we just make it over there to Idaho too. I mean, it's that close. Afton and Grover, all up there, is right, right close to the Idaho border. I spent some time up, yeah. up at some lakes. We used to call it Ghost Lake. I'm not sure if it was the name of it or not, but that's what we called it. And it was just beautiful up there. Just It was a smaller lake, and they would come in once or twice a month and stock it uh, with uh, trout. Oh, man. It was, we ate good all the time and easy because they're hungry when they get there, you know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Thunder. How you doing, bud? What else can we see? That, you know, they have a pretty good rodeo up there too. I think it's. Uh, I'm not really sure when now. Hey, Thunder. Bridger, yeah. Teton National Forest, uh, yep, Bridger is absolutely beautiful. Oh, <laughs> Scooter. Well, you had me going there, Scooter. <laughs> I know who you are. I won't mention your name, but I know who you are now. <laughs> Good to see you, bud. <laughs> He's a hell of a singer. Oh, excuse my French. He's a really good singer. He sounds a lot like George Jones when he tries. <laughs> and uh, he sent me a, 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 a file of him singing and then I, I uh, reverse engineered it and started over with it. Come out pretty cool. Yeah? Is that something you can use in your videos? I don't know. I'd have to get permission from him. Uh, there's there's Cajun. Idea. There's Cajun. Thunder. I was wondering if he's going to show up. Hey, John. Yes, sir. Thunder says that uh, you ought to use that picture of you in the blue shirt and sell it like other YouTubers do. <laughs> There's a couple of other pictures, and I'll probably make more money, but we won't talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> I would put some shirts up, or not shirts, I'd put some pictures up if I thought that I wouldn't be accused of e-begging. <laughs> uh, Thunder, are you talking about ISIS? I think you've told me that before, Thunder. You said I look best in blue. There's Isis. Isis. Yeah, Isis got to get on camera too. <laughs> she looks bored. <laughs> Typical dog look, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> See, what, what am I supposed to be doing here? <laughs> Actually, Scooter, you sound more like like uh, Boxcar Willie. Oh, cool! 
<laughs> uh oh, Alan's got a major problem. <laughs> yeah. I got a few of those. I might just do something like that, Gavin. You know, get some pictures up and edit them a little bit, make them look really good and stick them up there for sale. Is he taking a shower? <laughs> Right there in the Walmart parking lot. <laughs> Poor Alan. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, Kenny Rogers. Yeah, they, I've been told that before, Scooter. <coughs> I'm still looking for my Dolly Parton. Well, you know what they say. Hey, Tom. What do they say? You gotta put your microphone back on now. Now you're all out of frame. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to switch cameras. Hi, you, Rob. Haven't seen you in a month of Sundays, bud. You wanna scoot to your left a little bit, sir? To my left? Oh, there you go. Now that's better. Okay. Now you got a bunch of files and stuff behind you. Better net green screen hanging down there. You, you think? think? <laughs> yeah, you see my messy, my messy office. <laughs> Don't look messy. To oh me. well, we can't all be. We can't all be as perfect as John. Yeah. Right. I got half a green screen hanging down up there. I, every time I put it up, I walk past it and pull the string. <laughs> yeah, Lake says maybe you need privacy. Everybody close your eyes. <laughs> Remember that, uh, that song that we listened to up there in... Uh, in the mountains, the streaker. <laughs> they call him a streaker. <laughs> Too late, he'd already been mooned. <laughs> Thunder says he hey, thinks John. he's... A... Yes, sir. Oh, I'm sorry. Go, Go ahead. ahead. Uh, no, Rob, I'm, I'm in the motorhome at the moment. Uh... Well, see that's see what happens when you get old. You, you forget what you're gonna say. That's <laughs> gone now. I don't know what it was. Uh, scooters talking about your G string. <laughs> Wonder if that would sell. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Could you just see that? I think it'd probably be a first. <laughs> Gavin thinks you sound like Boris Karloff right now. 
You got a little bit of echo going there with you. I do now. Yeah. Uh, let me see. So how you been, Tom? Haven't seen you for a little while either, bud. <laughs> Put it on a blue light, blue light special. <laughs> Dame Bramage? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was that was nice RV. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the hair? <laughs> hey. Yes. I think I smell better too. <laughs> You quit fogging up your camera, anyway. <laughs> well, you know, I was just sitting here, and all of a sudden, it started getting dark. <laughs> I don't know um, why. <laughs> well, yeah, I didn't know why. I said, uh, you know, I know it's not cloudy outside, so I've got to. And uh, so, I wonder, well, what's going over the skylight that's cutting out all the light? <laughs> Hot in Oklahoma? Yeah. Wasn't there a song about uh, that? Tom. Hot in Oklahoma. <laughs> it does get hot in Oklahoma. Yeah. I had, I had somebody tell me Land one under time. Land the that, AC, Tom. I had somebody tell me one time that, that the Lord doesn't like Oklahoma. It's hotter than hell in the in the summer and colder than, and, 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 yeah, in the winter. <laughs> Ah, nice that you cleaned that up, John. Yeah. <laughs> well, Tom, it's it's nice to see you here. Uh, hope you'll join us the next time. I hope there'll be a next time. This has been such a fiasco for John and I to get this going. Oh man. How many times have we have we worked on this for hours at a time? Yeah. Just to get here. Uh, you wouldn't think it'd be so hard, but yeah, I know, and you know, and like I was saying, I used to do do this all the time, a long time ago, and uh, I never had any trouble. But things have changed so much that well, we finally well, got it going anyway. You know what? Uh, what's different about this one is it's not just you and uh, the viewers. Now you've got. You got two videos going into the mix from different parts of the country, but uh, anyway. Yeah, yeah, that was a yeah, good it's deal. It's working now, right? Um, next, the next thing we get, we'll do is is see if we can add some people into the into the panel like we used to. Those that want to come in. Tom is asking if we're planning on going to the RTR. Yeah, we talked about that when we when we left. We thought we'd come back out there, and then later, we you know you decided <laughs> you didn't. I, did we decide we weren't going to go again? Well, I did. Uh, I'll tell you what. With what they figure, they had. 5,000 people there. I don't remember what the count was, but it was it was way too many for me. Yeah. Um, it's that's. Too many, too many. So I don't think that I will go back to another RTR yeah. unless I I hear that uh, 
something has changed dramatically that makes it better than last year or this year? Well, you know, I just think we were in the wrong spot. We should have been down there where our green was. I think we were too close to, uh, uh, you know, where they do the, the the shows, the talks, and and then uh, yeah, and that kind of stuff. I I don't know. Well, we didn't have any interruptions or any any problems because of that. We were far enough away that we weren't hearing any of it. But you know, just the the people up and down the roads with those uh, ATVs, alien transport vehicles. Yeah. Uh, all day and night. You would think that uh, they would have uh, better manners than that. But they don't. Well, we certainly got a mouthful of that up there in the mountains there a few weeks ago, right? Oh, man. Yeah, that was uh, that was something else up there. Now, RB Free says that uh, I guess they parked far enough away from the main camp. Said it was nice, nobody around, and just uh, drove to the main camp. Yeah, we might do something like that. Well, we'll see when time time gets a little bit closer. Well, I'd, I'd be uh, up for going again myself. The only thing that I didn't like was uh, their internet. You know, it probably works oh, good. Oh yeah, that sucked. Probably works good in the summer because there's not a lot of people around. But when you yeah. get that many people all trying to get on that line at one time, I mean, for three days I wasn't able to do nothing. Yeah. So. Yeah. Well, I was there. Not, well, I was there last year in 2017, and it wasn't too bad last year. Um, there was only a few hundred people, uh, and it was the biggest one that they had had. And so that's the reason why I said, well, I'll go back again this year. But, wow, well, it mushroomed this year. Yeah, it did. Yeah, but uh, Bob Wells says that uh, it's going to be in a different place this year, or this next year, and uh, so we'll have have to see how that goes. Yeah, we'll see what happens. We might just get a wild hair and just go down there and just to cause a bunch of trouble, just because we can. <laughs> well. There was some of them did that last year. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Chris, how you doing? Now the knees uh, still the same. It's uh, it's better today. Been pretty good for the last two or three days, but I still got you know. There's obviously something wrong. I've got to go fix it. So it seems like every time I get up there on the mountain, Ellen, uh, I'd have a problem, and then have to turn and come back. Yeah. Um, Rob, where uh, John is in Arizona and I'm in Nevada. Oh, I and, thought you were in Nevada. Yeah, it's Nevada. <laughs> I'm sorry. I grew up here. I had to get that one in, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, Jeff. I got I got a couple of words for you when we get finished, John. Yeah, uh, yeah, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> RV Frida, um, you say from 500 to 5,000, is that what it went to this year? From five, 500 last year to 5,000 this year? Yeah, when we were that, there, it was 5,000. They estimated yeah. 5,000. Jeff, hey, hey, Jeff. RV Freeze uh -oh. High in Colorado. Hmm. Yeah. I heard about that state. <laughs> hey, uh, they've got uh, legal dispensaries there, don't they? They got what? Legal dispensaries? Yeah, it's all legal. I was there. watching somebody's. I was watching somebody's video the other day, uh, where they stopped at one of these dispensaries, went in and buy some 
thingies. Yeah. Scooter. Hate wild hairs, especially when you get when they get ingrown. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I said I'd, we might get a wild hair, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I know, Tom. <laughs> well, everybody's <laughs> are we free? Everybody's high here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so uh, Tom, our, Tom says you guys going camping up in the mountains this summer. Uh, we're gonna try our best. <sighs> that's for sure. If I can just get this knee thing over with and. You know, to where I can, I can pretty much depend on not having to come back home in a week. And yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm out of here. I think Alan's going to do the same thing. We'll probably meet up about the same place that we always do, and then we'll head out from there. Yeah. Yeah. Tom said he'd go for the shots instead of letting some sawbone. Which shots? I don't know. That they kind of did this way? <laughs> <laughs> Might do that too. Get, you know, that three or four shots in a beer, I'll be fine. <laughs> oh, hey, Gavin, that's a great idea. I missed that one. What do you say? He says he wished he could sell Girl Scout cookies next to the one of those pot shops in Colorado. <laughs> yeah, Arizona the same way, Tom. Um, it's not going to happen here anytime soon. Yeah, you know, at a risk when I was young. I smoked a lot, but not anymore. It uh, all it does is make me feel bad. Then I get hungry and then go to bed. <laughs> uh, I smoked it, but I didn't inhale. <laughs> yeah. Who said that? <laughs> you heard that before? <laughs> yeah. I have. I think. I think he forgot to in exhale. <laughs> go for the brownies there you go I like brownies lots of BLM in Colorado here's an idea uh, is there a BLM in, in Colorado RV he says there is I guess see there is yeah I remember being up there around Breckenridge and up in that area around the Eisenhower Tunnel and all up in there. I lived in Breckenridge for one season. Boy, that was cold. <laughs> cold? Yeah. Well, certain times of the year, yeah. It was, uh, I, get, I got a kick out of those people, though. They, they had a field day when the snow started melting. They found their trucks and they found their Volkswagens. And, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not saying that it snowed a lot. <laughs> yeah, I bet it is a little expensive now. It was always expensive anyway, just a little bit. Uh, Vicky, uh, you can't eat. Let's see. Let me get back to this. Uh, we can't even get the lottery here in Alabama, let alone a pot shop. Uh, let's put you in touch with Scooter. Okay. 
Scooter, you and uh, Vicky get together and, uh, you know. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> I don't, yeah, I think I was over the Loveland Pass, if I remember right. You know, it's been a long time since I've been even been in Colorado, so. Most of the time, there was nothing going on when I was driving over the road. It was hurry up and get through. Greeting from Portugal. Hey, Portugal, man. Portugal. How is it in Portugal these days? Empty? No, wait, that, that wasn't right. <laughs> Empty spaces. Yeah. Films. Well, John, uh, yeah, it's getting that time. Being, being the, the timekeeper, uh, they just need to let you know that uh, you've only got about five minutes before your appointment. So, okay. Is there anything you wanted to bring up while we're uh, still here? Well, um, we have other things on our, our list that we were going to talk about, but uh, we can save them for the next time, next one, okay. and hopefully it'll be better than this one. You know, we won't have uh, falling backdrops and you know <laughs> that kind of stuff. But uh, wow, that was fun. <laughs> uh, you know, those of you who are watching, um, it's. It's a little difficult for uh, John and I to sit down and just think of things to talk about, especially for an hour. Uh, it's it's gone pretty well, I think, this time. It's been nice uh, bantering back and forth with you guys. But if you could give us uh, an idea of what you'd like for us to talk about, that'd be great. Yeah. And uh, uh, just shoot John an email, and uh, you know through his. Uh, you will, you, you will, YouTube, <laughs> through his YouTube page, <laughs> and let him know what you'd like for us to talk about, and uh, we'll add that to the next one. I have a, a suggestion as well. Is Monday night going to be the, uh, a good thing? Um, I'm not sure when football, is football over? I was thinking, you know, if they have a lot of sports shows on Monday night. Uh, I'm not into sports, so I couldn't tell you. Yeah, I'm not either. Hey, thanks, Thunder. Well, let's let's do uh, let's we'll just see if we keep it at Monday night, and uh, you know we have a nice turnout. It looks like we're just getting started. So, uh, you know, if it starts interfering with sports nights and and that, well, we can always change. Uh, Empty spaces from it's Portugal. It's a good time. Yeah, empty spaces from Portugal. I want to tell you welcome, man. I'm really glad to you know to see you. Yeah. See you in here uh, Monday nights. We're gonna try to keep doing this. We start at five o'clock our time. Not sure what time it is there, but you know maybe you could come in a little bit early next time. Uh, you'll be able to see what's going on. I, I made uh, in order for me to have time to do this tonight. I had to make, uh, uh, yeah. what's the word? Uh, well, anyway, I was supposed to take somebody to Phoenix today, and I got out of that, but now i got to take somebody to uh, football practice. Uh, so, you know, it, at an hour it was all I could do. Yeah. Well, John, we're going to have to wrap it up for you to get to that. Uh, so anyway, thank you, everyone. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. John, I've had fun tonight. Uh, nice meeting a lot of you that uh, I haven't met before. And uh, hope you hope to, or I look forward to seeing you again in the next one. John? Yeah. 
Thank you, everybody. Really appreciate that. We had a nice turnout. Uh, you know, just like I said, for just getting started on this, and and uh, you know, eventually I'll figure out how to give notice. <laughs> and we fought with that for the last 15 minutes before five o'clock. So. Uh, yeah. Anyway, yeah, so this is the notice for next week, 5 o'clock, Monday nights. And thank you all. And like, like Alan said, thank you. come up with some, uh, uh, some stuff we can talk about, or we can just sit here and, you know, SS, <laughs> STS, whatever. Uh, you know, STS. Kind of, huh? Shoot. Yeah, you know, Shoot you the stuff, stuff, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for cleaning that up. <laughs> <laughs> I do what I can for you, John. Yeah, thanks, man. <laughs> uh, Jeff, Jeff Foster just showed up, and, and now we're leaving him. Oh, well. Oh, he's been here. Oh, Jeff's been here. Oh, did he? I missed him. All right, Jeff. Yeah. Okay. I let scroll by okay. fast sometimes. All right, guys. It does. I guess that's Thank it. Thank you much. Thank you, Alan. I had a good time, too. All right. You take care. You take we'll care. We'll see you later. See you later. All right. Bye-bye. Right. Bye. Bye. See, i got to go to VMix and try to figure out how to shut it off now. We spent two weeks trying to keep it going. <laughs> Now I can't figure out how to shut it off. <laughs> ah, stop streaming. <laughs>